Hey y'all, Mr. Tim's here. This is Yamaha 350 Bruin. Um, she's old and crusty, and uh, you know I've got got it painted over. But that's that's what we're working here with uh, the automatic two wheel drive um, Yamaha here. So let's show you what's been going on. So for a little while, I noticed when we crank it up, the starter would hang up and continue to run for a minute, and then it would stop. It got to the point here that came out one day the battery was dead. Went to go charge the battery. And, and when I went to crank it, it, the starter is just continually running. You can turn the switches off. You can have this off and you know, it's still trying to start. So ultimately led to just figuring out that it's the, uh, the solenoid down here uh, sending the signal. It to, uh, It's not cutting out the signal to the starter um, and it was just it's starting to burn it up. It's, I'm not trying to do anything, it's, it's, this is off. Nothing here, so I don't want that to continue to happen. <sighs> yeah, I don't want that to continue to happen and burn something up, so um, we are going to just change that solenoid out here. I've got a new part, uh, you know, Amazon part. This is what, $9, $10? It's a, it's an aftermarket China part, um, but we'll see if we can't get this on. I've got the old part out. Here's our old guy. Kind of rusty, crusty. Um, you see some of the bolts here are kind of hard to get out. And I just, uh, I sanded up all the connections and then put this back together. Got this plugged in. And before, when I immediately had this plugged in, uh, whatever connection it sent from the battery over here to the store, it just let it free flow. So it's hooked up now. Um, and so when it, now it's working properly. Uh, turning the switch on, I'm in neutral right there. Got the hand switch over here and Fire it up. Go. And in neutral, come over here to the switch. On. Little choke. Now she's running like she needs to be. Starter's not sitting there hanging up. Um, so I'm going to cut this off. My batteries, I got this up to my heavy charger here. Uh, the, the worst thing about this is the battery may have been uh, kind of messed up but from just being totally drained for so long. And um, so I'm gonna give it a good shot here with giving it a good charge now that it's not gonna have a constant drain on it. So um, seems to be working. Uh, I'll get everything uh, put back together and tucked up and uh, it was about a 15 minute job, not bad at all. So uh, thanks for watching. Y'all have any questions or comments, give me a shout.